How the devil are you guys? It's Robbie Don, it's William, and it's Dragon Age Origins. Now, at the end of the last episode, we had cleared Soldier's Peak out. Yes, we had. It was clear, it was ours. Now, we're back in the camp, and as you can see, one or two characters, like Sten here, have been uh, better equipped. Sten is now wearing massive armor, in fact, Sophia Dryden's ward and stuff instead of the medium stuff that was probably getting him killed as he's uh, supposed to be a warrior yes I think I'm going to have a quick walk around chat to everybody see if there's anybody needs anything else off their minds and double check my inventories to see if there are any gifts I think anybody would like so I'll uh, start with Alistair again my main man and work around the camp. Hey Alistair man. Something on your mind? Uh yes, I got of some course. question, matey. Right. Um uh, Yeah, tell me about the Grey Wardens. Such as they are. Yeah, will we need to start rebuilding the order? Is someone gonna come and do that for us? I mean Eventually, we would have to use the joining to make more Grey Wardens, right? But I don't know how to do the joining, or what's involved. I know it involves Lyrium and some other magic, and that it's really difficult to prepare, but that's it. Unless we can find out more about the joining, I guess we better get used to the idea that there might only be two of us for now. Until more come from elsewhere. Okay. So where's the headquarters? Here in Ferelden, there's our compound in Denerim at the palace, but that's it. Loghain will have control over that and be watching it, no doubt. Beyond that, the only place I know of is Weissacht Fortress. That's the headquarters of all Great Wardens in the Anderbelt, a thousand miles from here. But I've no idea how to even contact them. So unless Great. we try to get back to the compound in Denerim, I suppose the answer is no. There's nowhere for us to go. And... Yeah, what happens if we just leave? Just left? You mean just left for Elden? I yeah. don't know. If there's an archdemon, however, we're supposed to be the only ones who can defeat it. And that means the blight would grow unchecked. Eventually, other Grey Wardens in Orlay and other lands would hear about it and they would come to fight it, but they wouldn't come in time to save for Elden. There's no way. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere either. I'm just wondering how much time frame we had. Because if we could have gone to our lane, brought wardens back in enough time, it would have been worth it. Right, okay. No more questions then for now, my friend. About the Grey Wardens, anyhow. Fair enough. Something on your mind? Eh, uh, never mind. Okay, it is. Um, yeah. I think it's present time. I think I'll see you in a second, guys. Right, the gang have had uh, a few gifts off me, and apparently Liliana's very impressed. I found presents that she seems to like the most. Okay, so who are we on? Yes, let's try having a little chat with Stan. Hey there. Yes. Um, yeah, I'd. I want to discuss something you mentioned. Yeah, he's not in the mood for... He's not opened up enough. So that's enough. On. Okay. As Let's go. Wish. Okay. Uh, what about you, Liliana? I've opened up extra... Is it major or minor? I've, I've got you where you're... Kind of. No, not that, not that one. Is it that one? Uh, let's go to uh, Liliana, and where's is it? Is it this one you find plot? No, might not be that. Might be skills. Oh, there we go. Any plot? Oh, there we are. Plot. Minor cunning, moderate cunning. Okay. I have got Liliana's. Inspired moderate cunning. Let's see if she wants to talk about anything new. Something I can help with? 
Uh, yeah, let's just have a little chat. What's on your mind? Uh, you were travelling minstrel. Uh, do you have any tales to share, Liliana? Of course I do. I love stories far too much to keep them to myself. Everyone should be able to benefit from them, I think. Okay. Any Ferelden legends? I know one. Told to me by my mother a long time ago. It always chilled me to the bone. Maybe you have heard of Flemeth? Uh, yeah. We're talking about Morrigan's mother. Uh, are you sure? Was she the Flemeth of legend? Flemeth, the devourer of men. Flemeth, mother of witches. Flemeth, demon touched, who dwells in the mists. Uh, she didn't really introduce herself that way, to be honest. Ferelden mothers scare their daughters with talk of Flemeth. They say that if you're bad, Flemeth will spirit you away and bind you to her forever. They also say that Flemeth okay. mourns her lost beauty and will steal yours through your looking glass if she catches you. That fits that. That fits the um, tale Morrigan's telling. It takes children and then steals the beauty by basically stealing the bodies. Okay, that tell me the story. Flemeth's beauty was known throughout the land. She had hair like unto a moonless night, skin as pale as winter's first snow, and eyes as beautiful and perilous as the sea. When she came of mm -hmm. age, she came to the attention of the Lord of High Ever, Conobar, and he took her for his wife. Conobar soon uh, okay. learned that his young bride had the gift of magic. High Ever's my house. He kept this a secret, for he feared that she would be taken from him. Flemeth stayed with Conobar for some years, and with his blessing, she practiced her art. And then one day, a young poet named Osen came to the castle. Flemeth was captivated by Osen's voice, and he by her beauty, and they fell in love. Yeah, the, the plot thickens. Go on next. Flemeth longed to be with her true love, and she and Osen fled from Conobar's lands, seeking refuge in the Kokari wilds with the Chasin tribes. They lived there happily for many a year, till the day Flemeth received news that Conobar was dying and longed to see her face one last time. Flemeth's heart swelled with okay. pity for the man who once was her husband and begged Osen to return to Conobar's side with her. But when Flemeth and Osen entered Hyever, they were captured by Conobar's men and Osen was slain in front of Flemeth's eyes. Flemeth was imprisoned in the highest tower of the castle, there to await Conobar's judgment on her. Distraught at the loss of her love, hmm. Flemeth plotted revenge against her husband. She summoned a fey demon, intending for it to wreak vengeance on Conobar. But a spell went awry. The demon possessed Flemeth. Turning her into an abomination, the halls of the castle ran red with blood as Flemeth slaughtered Conobar and all his men. The last of Flemeth's humanity That's some melted strong away. Demon. And at dawn, she stole back to the wilds to plot and scheme for a hundred years. They say she took to her side many chastened men, and with their help, begat her daughter witches, who even now prowl the mm. dark places of the Kokari wilds. Okay, let's move on then. Thank you. Thank you. Interesting, interesting. We may listen to some more stories off you sometime soon. Now, who else is there? Marigun is over there. Don't really want to chat to her until we deal with her mother. Uh, yes. Now, we not no Zevran. I'm just checking in. You alright, guy? Yeah, you're alright, guy. Come on. Right, in that case, let's get some enchanting done. Yes. I want some enchanting. Thank you. Right, we have Austerian's Might and Expert 
Cold Iron Rune. It already does damage to the Dark Spawn, so let's give it a bit more. Thank you. We're done. Switch between that and something else. Right, where to next? In fact, I'd go as far as to say. Yes. Alistair, you can come. Um. Hmm. Who else to take? Not Adam yes. Well, we need wind, don't we? Let's face it. Otherwise, we're going to be dead a lot. And let's go with Liliana again. She's the most inspired, apparently. And let's head back to Soldier's Peak. Let's see if he has set up shop yet. He's had a few days. Well done, my friend. Well done. Dog. Why have you got a dog running wild? And party storage chest. Ha ha ha. Here we go. Plot items. No, I shall keep those. But what can I dump? That was no use to us yet. Let's dump a load of these things that uh, nobody can bloody wear yet. We need to check that one. <laughs> and medium armor. I keep contemplating putting that on. But right, let's stick with them. See if I can use them in a second. Alright, blood. Relax. 34 dexterity, so that's no use just yet. Right. Close. And let's check if I... No, I can't. Restri restriction mage. Okay. What mages do we have? Can you wear this? And what is it compared? Oh, yeah. You can wear that. Get it on. Direct. Get nicely done. And let's go sell stuff. Levi's nephew and Mikhail Dryden. Hi there. We will be again one day. Yeah, but as traders, bad looks of things. Hi there, Mikhail. You're the warden. My family owes you. Any weapons I make, I will sell you for a discount. Okay. So you're Indeed. a weaponsmith then. I have spent my life studying steel, dragon bone, and more. I learned all I could in human lands, and exiled dwarves taught me more. Give me the finest metals and materials, and I can make wonders for you. Oh, fine. Let's have a look at what you've got, mate. What has he got? Weapons. Oh, not bad. Armors. Ooh. Tier 6. He has got uh, some decent stuff, actually. Quite expensive. So we'll have to come back at some point for that. Lots of routine. Yes. I'll be back, mate, when I have the money. And who are these people? Fine, let's talk to Levy instead or Levi. Welcome How back, you doing, Warden. mate? As you can see, we've been busy. Clean the place up a bit. Even my brother Mikhail came out of hiding. Never will you find a finer smith. Also got some good stuff nice. here that might interest you. Buy them now before my cousins move it all someplace else. Okay. Did you um, tell them about I Sophia? About it, but I figured that it's not a bad thing to believe that you come from a line of lions, even if the truth is a touch yeah. more complicated. Our family's belief that we were wronged, it gave us strength to make something of ourselves. Okay, and what King do Ireland you think? sounded like a right nasty piece of work. Sophia was branded a traitor. She consorted with blood mages, but in spite of it all, I think she was a hero. Okay. Um, what about Vernus? Heard anything out of him? Not no dead yet, is it? Him. Seems to like keeping to himself, but I keep telling the children to stay away mm. from the tower. Okay, and uh, you have tidied up outside a bit. We've a big haven't family. You? When you were away, we all pitched in. Hard to believe they were undead demons and worse around here, right? <laughs> okay, what have you got on uh, in the shop, mate? Mm, okay, he has soul root bombs. And he has some ooh, recipes. Oh, 
Da 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 Soul Root Trap. Oh, Might have a bit of that. Soul Root Bomb and Soul Root. Yep, yeah, having a bit of that and that. Water. And you've got plenty of stuff for actually making it. Nice. W what I need is. It comes. Yes. Distillation. Distillation? Distillation. Distillation and corruptor. I'll have both of those. Thank you. And that concentrator. And let's see what the gang can make. We haven't got Morrigan, which is a shame. I don't think anyone else here is any good at making anything else. Trap making. Let's see what I can do. Not a damn lot. Bomb making. Uh, requires improved poison making. Poisons. Uh, yeah, where's... Uh, is it... Uh, it's Zephyrin who's probably good at that, isn't it? Right. Liliana, let's level you up a bit. All into dexterity. And give you a talent. What talent should that be? Improved poison making. Okay. Or improved stealing. <sighs> Ooh. Should we go around stealing? I mean, although I've said that, she's got improved stealing. No, let's um Yeah, improve poison making while we're here. Why in the hell not? And talents distraction Stealth Deadly Strike Archery, let's go with our archery, suppressor fire, aim. Hmm. Ooh. Okay, critical shot, suppressing fire. Let's go with suppressing fire for now and level up. Right, Liana, you happen to get this just at the right. Oh, look at that. <laughs> what can you make for us? You can make a bloody lot of them, right. You can only make one of those. That's, that's that out of the equation. You got four of those. And freeze bombs. One of those. And soul root. We need seven. Do we? Yes. We need a few more of those, don't we? Seven corruptor agents. Have we got any? Concentrated death root extract. Ooh, our death root extract. Right, let's. Uh, nicely done. So, so root bomb. Corruptor agent. Do you have any more, Dryden? What can I do for you, Warden? I'd like to see your wares. Certainly. Uh, do you have any more corruptor agents this side? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. I'm tempted to buy some more of these things. Poison making. Poison making. Herbalism. Herbalism. They're, they're master, whereas these are expert. Uh, I don't think she's got that, has she? She's got... What's she got? Is it improved? Improved poison making? I can't remember what I just checked she's got. She's got improved, so expert would be pointless. I'd be wasting my gold right now. However, we've got a lot of bombs. Let's go use them. Gabby, a party adventure for? Well, of course. Where to then? That is the question. Where shall we go? Hmm. Ban Lauren's lands? Or such as pass? Well, Ban Lauren's lands are a damn sight closer, so let's head there. <sighs> Alright. Who's this and what do you want? Okay, Darkspawn. Hey, 
Dax Bomb Mage. Okay, win. Um. Okay. New ability, Vessel of the Spirit. Spell acquired. What the hell is that? Vessel of the Spirit. Oh, okay. That's nice. So we have a new trick up Wind's sleeve. Um, right, Wind. This is where it's going to go. Hit them with Earthquake. The rest of us can focus on these. Get around the back, get around the back. And oh, kill him, kill him. Whoa! What are you doing, nearly dead? Let me guess, you got your back to somebody. Who have you got your back to now? Uh, heal her. Oh, that was a damn point. That's fine. How are we doing here? We're winning. But you need some potion down here. Yeah. Oh. And revive. Move freely. Whoa! Who is that? Him. Right, everybody. Change your plans, kill that thing as quickly as you can. Fine, she's down again. Doesn't matter, we'll be fine without her. And. Stun! Around the back! Get it killed. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. When keep up the healing, will you? Nope. Wrong one. She's stunned. Oh, great. Uh, take one of those while you're at it. When you wake back up. And you're down, my friend. Take a bit of that. And do you know what? I did all that without using my brain and changing to my better weapon. <laughs> Although I do get better he healing, so, you know. Is everybody? No, it's not all your blood, Alistair. Oh, I know what the problem is. We need to go and uh, wake Liliana up, don't we? No, we don't actually. There, there. What about? Right, everybody go down there. Everyone remember where she parked. Actually, while we're going past, get that. I don't think they're paying attention. I wonder if we can wake her up. Win. Over here. See if we can encourage Liliana to wake up. Apparently we can. Okay then, we're going to have to do this the old fashioned way. Let's get a bomb ready. And can I take out, how many can I take out in one go? Haha! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want to be like that, do you? Fine, you want to be like that? Here, have a bit of this. Your turn. Ooh, got to hurt. Let's smash that down. Woohoo! And, if, oh, more, more yet. More yet. I have other bombs, don't I? 
Yes! Look at that. Your turn, my friend. Is that everybody? That was interesting and draining. Okay. Um. Yeah. What happened? Who summoned who? Did you summon a spirit, or did the spirit just decide to uh, summon you? The spirit that sustains me, so that it could lend us aid. I did not realize it would take this much out of me. It seemed a good idea at the time, if a little rash. I think it may have weakened the spirit a little. Uh, anyway, that does I make sense. Right now. And it seems that my little trick could be useful in a pinch. Uh, in a pinch is the operative part of that f sentence. Too much and you're probably going to kill yourself, so I don't want you exerting yourself. Not every I'm five minutes, alright? And thank you. Your concern is touching. Alright. Oh, she's awake. Well done. Getting yourself knocked out. Alright. I shall do it. Time for oh, it's gone. Oh, can't do it that way. Fine. Some elf root. And some death root if I can get to it that way. So Wind's found a new uh, a new trick, has she? She has indeed. Right. In that case, let's continue where we were going, which is down here somewhere. Continue on our way. Although I do think, ah, oh, luckily I don't have to smash the gate down. Hmm. Okay, take a closer look at the unarmed man, take a closer look at the guards. Let's have a quick look at the guards. The guards wear the uniform of Ban Lauren, a minor lord well known and little love for the fluidity of his allegiances. Take a closer look at the unarmed man. You are surprised to recognise the uniform of King Kaelin's honour guard. Our memory comes to you, you fought alongside this man at Ostagar. Let's uh, go and join the fray. I've got someone I fought with and uh, somebody who has an army with a reputation. Okay. Bad idea guys, real bad idea. And Win while we're at it. You too. <laughs> Private militia. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Uh, while they're still stuck on there, let's give them a taste of this one. Get up. Try again. Pity's sake. <laughs> Alright. Silly boys. No chance now. I say after they stun me. Who's left? Somebody do something about this guy here. Who do you think he is? Thank you. And your turn. Dirty fighting for the win, I suppose. <laughs> Anybody left? Right. That's poor bugger. He not coming up with a loot, he's coming up with an interact. Probably still semi alive. 
Let's do some looting quickly before he dies. And before I get kicked from the, the area. Heavy militia. Heavy chainmail boots. Red steel. Ooh, heavy boots. Take them. Take that. And take some elf root. And now he has a quest marker above his head. What's his name? Elric. Right, Elric, wait your turn. Yes. Elric. The dying man. Something needs to be done about that. <laughs>